All right, Zach Albaverde from SEC Country here with four-star cornerback C.J. Henderson at the Under Armour All-America check-in. C.J., first of all, what does it just feel like to be here in, in Orlando for this event? Uh, it's a great feeling to come out here with the, with the nation's best athletes and just come in and compete. Well, has, has this always been a goal for you to be an All-American in either one of these games and just be on this stage? Uh, yeah, it was always a big dream. It was something I never expected. What, what, what was the feeling like when you got the invite? Uh, when I got the invite, I was so excited. <laughs> I just want to get in and compete. Awesome. Um, who are some of the guys you grew up watching in this game? Um, or anybody you remember? Yeah, I got to watch Jayden Tabor, um, Dory Jackson, um, Ivan Marshall, a lot of those guys. <laughs> CJ, what's the recruiting process been like for you? Uh, before the dead period, it got crazy. It was something that I couldn't just sleep, staying up, like, talking to coaches and stuff like that. Wow. What about in general, just like the whole process? Has it been has it been overwhelming? Has it been fun? What have the emotions been like for you? Uh, I haven't really been overwhelmed. I got I learned how to control it, so it's been good. What would you say the high, what have been some of the highlights for you? Just some of the moments that have just stood out the most, been fun or memorable? Uh, just probably that first first month or so getting recruited. Did right. you expect it to happen, or did it just kind of blow up for you? Uh, I expected it, but no. Nah, it was like yes and no. Over time, what, what staff do you think you built the best relationship with? Uh, Miami and Florida. What is it about those two that stand out? Um, Coach Rump, I really get to relate to him a lot. Me and him the same position, same a lot of everything that we've done. In Florida, um, I just get there a lot, and I just get to feel for it like that family. Is that the school you visited the most? Florida? Yeah. No, I think I visited mine more. Okay. How tough has it been in your mind just going through this process, maybe knowing it, it might come down to those two and just trying to decide in your head like where you want to go, mm -hmm. trying to pick between those two? How hard has that been? Uh, it's been tough, but I know I have to decide sooner or later on which, which school I can see myself at. When you made that decision, what was it going to come down to? For you, I mean, what are like the main factors that you're gonna choose from? Um, probably what school I feel most comfortable at. It really be. Now, you got two guys from Miami that, that you're close with that are going to Florida, two uh, pranksters, oh, yeah. and Sean and, and Kamori. How much do you talk to those guys? And I mean, do y'all talk about Florida? Do you talk about recruiting? Or are you guys just strictly friends? How, how does how's that relationship? Oh, uh, we do every once in a blue moon, but we get we talk like. Probably often, like every week or so, we get to talk with each other, play around, cry jokes and stuff like that. Do you guys ever have a serious conversation, or is it jokes the whole time? No, I think we always. Kind of <laughs> <laughs> what do you What do you like about those those two guys, and and what would it be like to play with them at Florida? Uh, I grew up with them, so I know I know how we would be together as a group. I know how dominant we could be. So. You're gonna officially visit Florida January 20th. Mm -hmm. um, You've obviously been in the UF a lot. What are you looking forward to going into that trip? Is there anything you still need to see or that they need to show you? Uh, I just want to get the official feel for it and just, just see, check everything out. And Kamori and Sean will be there. I mean, what do you think it'll be like to hang out with those guys for a whole weekend in uh, a college town? <laughs> yeah, that'd be hilarious. And then, uh, family-wise, uh, parents or family members, or who who in your family is is the ones that are kind of helping you with this decision? that you're kind of talking to about it? Um, probably more my dad, because he's more into football and stuff. What are, what are the things that, that matter most to him? Um, he just want me to make the right decision for me, make sure I'm comfortable with that school, the co coaches, and make sure they'll treat me right. And when signing day comes for you, you make your announcement, you sign uh, the paper. Well, what do you think that moment's going to be like for you, just to have it all over with and know where you're going? Uh, I think it's really crazy after I'm doing all these four years hard work and sweating and all that. Are you going to have a signing day ceremony? Is that probably when you'll announce? Most likely, yeah.